Armina, we'll start with you. What did you make of Richardson's performance last night? Yeah, well, coming off of the uh, completion percentage over expectation number, I, I think his preseason his performance last night is such that the numbers, if you're just kind of box score scouting, don't really capture everything he did and did well. Um, don't think his receivers helped him out in certain situations, both with drops. Probably the best throw of the night was dropped by the rookie Josh Downs and separation. So I just want to say that. I think watching this offense, it looks a lot like we expected it to look when they drafted Anthony Richardson, knowing that Shane Steichen was the head coach. A lot of play action, emphasis on the RPOs. Jalen Hurts had to be on that opposite sideline watching those RPOs, saying, Shane, I thought that was our thing. We do the RPOs. Well, now <laughs> Anthony Richardson does the RPOs, and he does them very well. Uh, another thing I, I noticed, uh, which I think is going to be something we're going to see a lot during the regular season, is the impact that merely the threat of him keeping the football and running has on defenses and how it helps the Colts' run game. On the third drive, where they scored a touchdown near the goal line, this wasn't the scoring run, but Evan Hull, who was their backup running back, we'll see how he moves up the death chart with Jonathan Taylor, um, it was zone read, and the linebacker was absolutely paralyzed by Anthony Richardson, the threat of him keeping wide open lane for Evan Hall. I think we're going to see that a lot during the season. I think the run game will flourish as a result. Mina, you're absolutely correct to say that we saw a lot of the RPOs and the, the elements of the passing attack that we expect with Anthony Richardson, but something has been missing during the preseason that I feel confident we're going to see come the regular season, and that is the designed quarterback run game. We have not seen very much of that so far with Anthony Richardson in the preseason. Only three as far as I can tell, uh, designed quarterback runs for Richardson, one of which came last night and was 16 yards on a zone arc bluff where they, Anthony Richardson read a defensive end, kept the football, and ran for 16 yards. That's going to be an essential part of their offense. We saw it with Jalen Hurts over the past couple of years in Philadelphia, and that's going to create both running lanes for the other running backs and play action opportunities and throwing lanes for Richardson as yeah. a passer. Yeah, Bill, I think your, your optimism is correct on uh, the, the idea that he'll run more in the regular season. They know he can run, and, and there's no reason to, to put him in harm's way and also you know, <laughs> take time away from what he needed to work on this preseason. And the stuff he needed to work on this preseason, he still needs to work on, which the Colts knew when they drafted him. But the word I keep hearing out of that building is poise. That he, when they put him in the preseason game the first time, they were impressed with his poise. There were things he did very well. There were things that he did not do so well, but they feel like the latter category, he can improve. Most importantly, the decision to start the season with him as the quarterback has a lot to do with that poise and their belief that when things inevitably go wrong, as they always will with a rookie quarterback, particularly one as inexperienced as Anthony Richardson, that it won't affect him emotionally or mentally in a damaging way. And I think that's vital. He'll be able to learn from his mistakes, but it won't, it won't hinder his progress. That's at least the belief inside of that building. You know, it's funny, thinking about the three quarterbacks that went in the top four, Bryce Young, C.J. Stroud, played at such dominant levels because of the programs they were in and the team around them. It's been an adjustment so far in the NFL in the preseason. Anthony Richardson is like exactly what he was billed as, right? Like immense upside. It's going to yep. take some time. There are going to be some moments that make you shake your head, and there are going to be other moments that make your jaw drop. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.